Sonic Blankets is a participatory installation and workshop that explores interactions between sounds, objects, movement and environment. The workshop utilises a movement sonification system and is inspired by somatics and Pauline Oliveros' deep listening practice. It consists of three parts and involves working indoors and outdoors. This video documents a workshop that took place in November 2021 in Dyer Hall, Huddersfield. If, for example, you think today about your journey here, uh, I, I imagine that it involved a lot of seeing and looking, like looking on boards and looking on maps, looking at the signs of the streets. Uh, so it was a very visual centric, popular centric um, experience. Um, and it's really interesting to kind of acknowledge uh, habits and preferences and modes we bring in the space. So the reason I would like us to close our eyes is that we move away uh, from that or we kind of we quieten it down. We began with a somatic warm-up which aimed to awaken the participants' auditory and kinesthetic sense. Through conversation and guided scores, the group was led to move and sound in relation to the indoor environment and the surrounding objects. Participants were invited to explore the way their movement in and through the space could enable them to hear different sounds. The task also included touching and moving objects in order to create new sounds. The second part of the workshop took place outside. Um, so yeah, we're going to split into groups of two, and then someone is going to guide the other person blindfolded, or like with your eyes closed. <laughs> This was followed by a recording task, which involved the selecting and collecting of sounds in a recording device. Here the participants employed the same approach we explored indoors. The sounds were produced through different interactions with objects and surfaces. Upon their return, the sounds were input into the movement sonification system. The sensors were attached to the blankets and in this way they became an interface between movement and sound. The participants had an opportunity to play with the sounds that are part of the Echo Home Library as well as the sounds they recorded outside. The blankets offered a tactile means through which the sound could be triggered and manipulated. As a blanket invites a range of different movements, it serves as an interface through which the body could work with the sound. This can expand the participant's range of movement and it can also create opportunities for different aspects of the sound to emerge. The feedback between the listening and the moving object make possible an active sculpting sound. Thank <laughs> you.